Here we are, Angel Stadium in Anaheim, the Eagles' first practice for Sunday's game against the Rams. As we talked about in Seattle, not only is this a must-win game for the Eagles against the Rams on Sunday afternoon, it's really a measuring stick game for this team. They lost their margin for error in the race for home field advantage. You look across the city to the Los Angeles Rams, they're built very similar to the Eagles. Jared Goff and Carson Wentz both talked about on Wednesday how close they came to being drafted by the other team. Goff said he was actually in a meeting with the Eagles when he found out out the Rams traded up to the number one pick with the Titans. You look at the Rams, they have Todd Gurley, an elite running back who contributes in the passing game. The Eagles might have the deepest running back core in all of the NFL with LeGarrette Blunt, rookie Corey Clement, and Jay Ajayi, who they traded for at the deadline. Wide receiving cores, it's Alshon Jeffrey against Sammy Watkins, and two very dominant and aggressive and opportunistic defenses with the Rams and the Eagles going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. So this is a critical game for the Eagles. If they lose, they will have lost head-to-head -head tiebreakers against both the Seahawks and the Rams, which could mean they travel out in the NFL playoffs. Also, if they win, it puts them right back in the hunt for that number two seed in a first round bye. Depending on what happens with the Minnesota Vikings, they could even go back up to the number one seed. But this is a big game. It's a measuring stick game, and it's a bounce back opportunity for the Eagles. We'll see how they handle the week in LA, how practicing in a baseball stadium with only one field impacts their preparation. And we'll know all we need to know about this team and their chances in the postseason after Sunday at the Coliseum.